two, three, four, get my shoes and out the door. Five, I'm alive, six, seven, eight, feeling great. Nine, I'm gonna shine, life is good. I'm doing fine, ten, gonna do it right and do it again, yeah. I look into the sky with all the beautiful color, but there's more than just for me, so gonna share it with another. I got to show, to give, let out, I want to sing and shout. Take a look and see a beautiful morning that turns into a beautiful evening, and together make a beautiful life. And if you want, hey guys, how's it going? Today, I am home from work. I am getting ready to cook some supper and I am preparing myself because we're supposed to have a nasty week of weather. Uh, apparently, it's either going to be a lot of snow or a lot of rain or a wintry mix. And I don't know which of those three would be the worst, but it's all going to be based on where the temperature falls and ugh, it's just going to be nasty. Nasty weekend. It's already pretty bad. I said I fell down this morning. There's ice just outside our garage and It's always when you have to go back for something like I made it to my car and I was like, oh shoot I forgot my phone. So I was heading back to go into the house. I stepped outside of the garage and whew, Bam went down landed on my side hit my arm. I like smashed one of my fingernails It was not fun, but so now we're home. Jessica should be home anytime. I had just enough time to put in away some Christmas packages that had come in for her. And yeah, I'm gonna start getting ready. Finally gonna cook that meal that I was out shopping for last week. I had seen a recipe, it was a Gordon Ramsay thing for pork and peppers. Pork and peppers. So I'm gonna try, try it out, see what I can do. Master Chef has inspired me to get back into my cooking swing and actually like cook stuff that didn't come out of a box. Or at least try to. That's usually how these things turn out. Is it's a try to thing, not an actually do thing. So we'll see how this all turns out. Hey guys, Jess is home. Hi. And she has a big box over there that's not a Christmas present. Well, as far as I know. I don't know. Not for me. It says... Doesn't say do not open until. Oh, I kind of wanted to send her a snap. <laughs> okay. Got priorities here. Hold on. I know. Okay, just a second, guys. I have to you'd be like, the, what is this face? It's a process, snapping. Okay, wait. I think I go this way. Aha! Should we wait till Christmas? Doesn't say wait till Christmas. It doesn't, doesn't say on the back anywhere. No. It feels like it might be some sort of painting. Maybe, um, that's what I'm kind of thinking. But no. Oh. <gasps> what? Did you see is it? it? No, I'm just saying is it, it looks like it's, is it wrapped? Yeah, it's wrapped. But it looks like it's wrapped. I don't know, Jen! <laughs> What the heck is it? I don't know. And it's like wrap wrap. That's what I meant. Yeah, it is. Okay, it's starting to feel more like a picture frame at this point. <gasps> it's a painting. <gasps> I'm so excited. It's totally a Christmas present. It's okay. You've opened, you started now. I know, but you gotta I, go. I can you gotta, stop. You gotta go. I it's too late. I should have stopped. No, it's too late. You gotta go. The people need to know now. They can wait if I can wait. You couldn't, you opened it. <laughs> you made me! That'll never hold up in court. Yes, it will. Jen painted it. I'm so excited. It's a portrait of me. I commissioned oh, her. I need to get this stuff. Oh, that's that fancy. Fancy, Jen. Maybe it came with it. Do you guys want to see it before I see it? Oh, it's so cute! OMG! I was making a face. Jen sent you a snap that says, wait till Christmas. Are you? No. <laughs> brat. Freaking brat. Oh my word, it's so awesome. Did she send me anything? No, she didn't. 
Oh my word, I love it. Now I'm thinking, where can I put it? <laughs> I think I'm gonna put it in the living room. I'm gonna put it like above the couch. There's the painting. I love it. There it is, guys. I love it. It's pretty to cute. Another snap. <laughs> We're sorry if this was supposed to wait, Jen, but I it had to be hung up. Oh, I love it. It was too cute not to hang up. Yep. And Derek made you open it. Yeah. <laughs> it's my fault. I'm sorry. I just, I, I forced her beyond her will to open the present. <laughs> oh. If it were me, I would have stopped when I got to the wrapping paper. Don't even go there. I wouldn't have stopped. Check out this kid. He's cooking an actual meal tonight. I'm like all trying. fancy and stuff. I'm trying. We got like peppers and like red onions and pork. Red wine vinegar, olive oil, extra virgin olive oil. Trying to be prepared. Taking it slow. One step at a time. He's got this. You got this, babe. Thank you. You got some crackles going on over here. What's that? What is okay. Look at that plating and everything. Look at that. Wow. That, 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 that came out all right, right? That looks amazing. Hopefully it tastes amazing. <laughs> wow. That can be your plate or if you want me to do one yeah. off with less peppers. But or... Yeah, I'll do one with less peppers. Okay. <laughs> Look at these, you guys. He did so good. Good job, babe. Thanks. It smells amazing down here. Oh, it does. Oh, yeah. Guys, I was really nervous about this meal. But I must have done all right. Because Jessica is eating the peppers. Yeah. I don't eat peppers. Or at least I haven't before. I think it came out pretty good. Mm. I think there are definitely things I could improve upon in the future. I think the peppers are cooked just right though. Like The peppers are good, yeah. I think the pork chop could... A little... Got to get my seasoning right on it. Yeah. Maybe a little bit more salt mm -hmm. and more evenly spread out. But the pepper on the thing is fine and just cooked maybe just a half a second less. Yeah. Like a minute less or something. Yeah. I think Woo! the time I cooked them for would have been perfect if they were a little bit thicker. So if I'm dealing with this kind of pork chop, a little bit less on each side. But overall, I'm, I think I'm pretty happy with how they came out. I'm very happy. You did great. Yes. yes. And you guys need to know that I'm a piggy eater. Like, the fact that I'm eating these peppers right now is, mm -hmm. like, a big deal. Yeah. Jessica was always a very, very picky eater. She's become quite adventurous. Mm. But still, still good. Shape. Yeah, like, four years ago, would not be eating this right now. But. Peppers and sushi, that's the type of person you are now. Who would have thunk it? Who would have thunk it? Yes, Jessica's, I always like cooking my meals for Jessica before I cook them for anyone else because she can be honest with me without hurting my opinion. And if Jessica likes it, then there's a good chance that the <laughs> next person I serve it to it. will like it. Mm -hmm. So it's a good, it's a good, it's a good testing ground. Mm -hmm. Molly really wants to test it too. But it smells amazing. I mean, it oh, smells that, so that's good. the best part. It just smells so good when you're cooking it. Mm. All right, I'm going to go back to eating it, it now. It can't be that unhealthy. No. Well, guys, we wrapped dinner up, and it all came together pretty well. Cleaned up nicely. We tag-teamed it, got it all cleaned up, and a little bit of leftovers there that I think I might bring to my dad tomorrow at work because he always likes to sample the foods I've been cooking. But overall, I'd say it went pretty well. It's going to become one of our staple meals. I, I would definitely cook this meal again. If anyone's wondering, it's Gordon Ramsay's pork and peppers. 
that I cooked. I think the video's right on YouTube. But that's I I I've been watching Master Chef. I felt inspired. I wanted to cook. I I love cooking. I love cooking. Jessica's Jessica's always so helpful with my lighting. I always forget. I love cooking. I've always wanted to cook. I just don't take the time to do it sometimes. And so this was a good this is a good practice meal. I love that painting, by the way. It just looks so awesome right it's above so you. Perfect. Like, it does, like, it's so just good. awesome. Oh. Thank you, Jen. Thank you so much, Jen. All my word. Freaking love it. Derek thinks she and I should open an Etsy shop. Yep. And just sell our painting. Going to business. Yep. Krista and Katie can do sewing. So it makes stockings. You yes, can have you can oh include stockings God. with your painting purchases. No. No. You have to pay for those too. Yes. <laughs> but we are going to uh, be getting ready to call the vlog a little early tonight. It is once upon a time night, so we're gonna watch that, and I'm gonna try and get the vlog done early and at least uploaded tonight, uh, so that well. You'll have seen it by now, but with the bad weather coming, Jessica's home tomorrow, so I have to get it uploaded before the morning tomorrow so that it's not killing the internet while she's here. And okay. uh, the weather is supposed to be really crappy the next couple of days, so if it's like icy and we end up losing power, I want to make sure this video is up and ready for tomorrow and buy us a little bit of time. So. He's such a thinker. I try and think ahead. I'm a planner. Thanks for watching today, guys. We hope you enjoyed the video. Uh, like we always say, if you enjoyed the video and seeing me struggle through trying to cook a decent meal, leave a thumbs up. <laughs> Let us know you enjoyed the video. And be sure to subscribe to the channel, and that way you always see our new videos. We put up a new video every single day. We'll be back with another video for you guys tomorrow, but until then, bye, guys. Bye, guys. Beautiful morning that turns into a beautiful evening, and together make a beautiful if you want to see, then come along with me, that's right. And if you want a good tomorrow, it's pretty simple, gotta find the light to follow. And if you do, you have a future real bright. And it's a combination of consistency.